Here we are with Grand Prix Final champion Nathan Chen. Congratulations on your win here at the Grand Prix Final. I would like to know how you strategize for your programs. I know that yesterday you weren't sure how many quads you were going to try today. Um, do you know before the six minute warm up, after the six minute warm up, are your coach and you sitting back there with a calculator and a pencil and a pad of paper um, wondering what you're going to do? Or are you deciding it all on a whim when you are skating your free skate? Um, today was mostly planned. Um, I skated a really good warm up this morning um, and everything went exactly as I'd planned it. Um, and I definitely wanted to push the technical caliber a little bit more than what I've been doing all season and add the fourth quad in. Unfortunately, um, didn't go as to plan today, um, but I'm glad that I still attempted it. I'm glad that I put myself out there to, to try that quad since it's totally different um, performing it in competition versus in practice. Um, but other times, you know, it really it really differs. Sometimes if I have a really awful six minute warm up, we uh, reevaluate and just think about like what is most realistic in this p period of time and then just make sure that I hit all like the guidelines of uh, technical or the technical guidelines, making sure that everything is on point. I understand how overwhelming it is to stand in your starting position and know the difficulty that lies ahead in the next four and a half minutes or four minutes. What did you feel like today standing in your starting position? Did you feel calm? Did you feel nervous, stressed? Mm -hmm. Um, today the music didn't really start as soon as I, I th as I thought it would, so that was a little bit, um, I don't know, that was a little distracting, but as soon as the music starts, you know, I'm right back to where I am, and normally, you know, it's just trying to stay as calm as possible, get my breathing in order, um, and just focus on every single thing that I need to in the, in the short span of time that I have. And I know that you are still in the middle of your career, nowhere near the end, I hope. But have you ever thought about when it's the end of your career and you are having your last performances, what type of legacy you'll have left on men's figure skating? Um, I mean, it's hard, hard to say right now. Um, I'm definitely you know, hoping that at the end of my career, I'll be able to put out all the performances that I've dreamed about, making sure that I'm you know, able to continue to push the sport technically. Um, and also improve on all the things that I know that I lack at, in some performances. Um, but I mean, at the end of the day, I love skating. And regardless of what I do, you know, I'll, I'm still happy with everything that I've done already. Um, even if I couldn't skate tomorrow, you know, I'm, I'm really satisfied and proud of everything that I've already done. Well, congratulations here at the Grand Prix Final, and I look forward to watching you for the rest of the season. Thank you.